Chicago. Up next, the latest planned merger and acquisition would be a blockbuster in audio entertainment. Cash, credit, debit, and totally free. The WBBM Noon Business Hour continues. Satellite radio company Sirius XM wants to buy music streaming service Pandora in a deal valued at $3.5 billion. Let's examine the deal with the help of Tim Hanlon, founder and CEO of the Verter Group here in Chicago. Uh, Tim, so uh, give us the nuts and bolts of this deal and why these companies want to do this. Uh, hi, Cisco. The... Um... The reality is that, uh, obviously, uh, like a lot of things in television and video we've discussed before, the same is applied to uh, uh, radio, what used to be known as radio or still is known as radio and audio. Um, and this is uh, actually a tie-up that, uh, once approved, uh, is actually uh, the culmination of a relationship that uh, began about a year ago uh, when SiriusXM took a minority stake in uh, streaming service Pandora, um, about a 19% stake. So, in essence, what... Uh, what SiriusXM is doing is buying the rest of uh, Pandora that they uh, did not already own. And the reality is that uh, they both need each other. Uh, the satellite uh, radio business, as is known, say, 10 years ago, uh, Sirius and XM merging being two of the, the two original satellite radio companies. Now, the technology is really a very strong one-way downstream technology uh, that is now if primarily fully penetrated uh, in automobiles. Uh, it's a great service. There's lots of different content to choose from, but it is nowhere uh, as flexible as uh, as the Internet can provide. And that's clearly where Pandora uh, and its chief competitor, Spotify, have excelled over the years. Uh, that is to enable streaming of, uh, of music content and a whole bunch of uh, discoverable and uh, uh, recommendational and uh, just uh, all kinds of nuances to create play- playlists and favorites and all that kind of stuff. And that sort of internet backbone of what, what Pandora has um, is desperately what Sirius XM needs uh, now that the cars are basically fully penetrated uh, and uh, they could use a little bit of uh, that sort of that internet app kind of magic. And Pandora, frankly, could use a little bit of a, uh, uh, a boost inside the automobile as that technology gets more sophisticated uh, and much more um, unencumbered because of the internet. Now, uh, well, you know, maybe what you said there helps me understand this a little more, because if you're Sirius XM, I mean, anyone with the infrastructure can put together a website and, and can stream. Uh, so why take on Pandora then? Why, why not just try to do your own thing? Yeah, that's uh, something actually that Sirius XM has uh, tried to do over the last number of years. And their uh, their Internet offerings, while not bad and, 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 and fairly decent, have been largely... Uh, a mere replication of their streaming uh, channels. Uh, when you get into the worlds of Pandora and Spotify, uh, you're getting more into the realm of consumers being able to choose, select, uh, remix, uh, curate, uh, and frankly, uh, bring up uh, content and, and um, uh, songs on demand uh, on their own sort of uh, terms. And that's sort of that missing interactive piece, I guess, or that consumer control piece that Sirius XM currently lacks. So strategically, it makes a lot of sense for both companies uh, to kind of combine themselves. And the company behind all this, Liberty Media, certainly knows that. What's a go-shop provision? What does that mean? Uh, That's a standard uh, nomenclature for um, uh, essentially to keep both sides protected uh, if uh, others uh, decide that they want to step up and possibly uh, make an alternative bid. But uh, that's uh, it's pretty standard nomenclature. I doubt very seriously that uh, anybody's going to challenge this deal. It makes so much sense strategically, especially given that SiriusXM is already a a 19% owner uh, in Pandora already. Tim Hanlon, founder and CEO of the Verter Group. Thanks for joining us here. We'll have you back again soon.